A little blast of winter weather is expected tonight and into tomorrow. I'm Chief Meteorologist Mike Hurd. Here's the latest on-demand forecast. Here comes a cold front later tonight. A lot of moisture behind the system, a lot of cool air, a couple of wheat disturbances there as well. So our southwest flow is going to change to a northwest flow eventually. But high wind highlights are still up. A wind advisory for the living scenario is ongoing. Uh, guests up there to 60 miles per hour possible tonight into tomorrow. Here's where we expect to see the brunt of the heavier snows, especially above 6,000 feet. You're probably looking at 4 to 8, 6 to 10, maybe even up to a foot if you get above uh, eight or 9,000 feet. So there are going to be some difficult travel here across the Madison and Gallatin ranges and down into Island Park, Idaho. And Yellowstone National Park, there are winter storm warnings out through this evening into Thursday evening. Some parts of the park could have over two feet of snow at higher elevations, but during lower elevations around two to four, 48, somewhere in that range. So a little bit of valley rain and mountain snow with this uh, system off and on throughout the day tomorrow, but eventually cooler air and then a little bit of hit and miss snow as we look into Thursday night into Friday, but most of this will be gone by the time we dive into the weekend. This model still being semi-aggressive here in some areas. I think 8 to 12 is a little high. However, that's a possibility uh, for Big Sky and West Yellowstone. I think 4 to 8 is probably more realistic. But regardless, so there's going to be snow and blowing snow down there as we go through the next 48 hours.